of Power Slap's most active competitors, Emmanuel Muniz, makes his sixth appearance tonight, and he expects to make it his most spectacular one yet when he meets Cole Cole Sandgun. Aiming to win titles in Power Slap and the UFC, 23-year-old Emmanuel Muniz has the ambition of youth and the poise of a veteran as he's won three bouts against Mike Webster, Wesley Drain, and Christopher Debo on Slap Fighting's biggest stage. To accomplish the first half of his goal, Muniz needs to keep winning here in Vegas, and that's the plan when he meets Cole Young. Unbeaten in power slap with a knockout of Jay Rivera and a draw with Anthony Blackburn, the bow hunter from New York is aiming for an upset against Muniz tonight. Coming up next, Emmanuel No Love Moonies battles Cole Bull Send Young. These fighter walkouts brought to you by 10X World, 10X Your Business, 10X Your Income, 10X Your Life. Go to 10xworld.com. Big time outdoorsman is Cole Bull Send Young from upstate New York, Hornell, New York to be exact. I learned something from Charlie. I didn't know he was a rattlesnake hunter and he was huh. eating his prey. Yeah, well, that just sounds disgusting, if I'm honest. But still, this guy, Cole Young, getting better and better all the time. He said he loves the opportunities that Power Slap is giving him. He said, I'm making a lot of money financially. This is making a huge difference for me, of course. He wants to spend as much time as possible with his son. He said he's been working so hard, training with his coach, Hoss Coates. Uh, he said that he's a genius in striking. He's working out with him about four times a week. He said, the power that I'm generating now compared to when I first started, he said, it's day and night. And now I'm also, I'm not fouling, I'm not stepping. I'm being sure to follow the rules, improve my technique, generate more power, and providing better income for his family. I just noticed he's not wearing shoes. I wish he would have asked yeah, oh, us about that. I don't like that at all. You got, you just don't have as much traction. When you have a tread, when you have a shoe, regardless what kind of shoe, you got more traction, you got more grip, you got to generate more power. Well, we will see if he bucks the trend here tonight. The former all-conference linebacker in high school in Southern California, Emmanuel No Love Muniz, 23 years old. One of the youngest and most experienced competitors in Power Slap. Last four matches have gone to a decision, so there is no doubt this young man has a chin. Yeah, absolutely. Never been knocked out either. I mean, as you said, the old decisions. Former footballer, as you said, he's big for the weight class. He used to be a middleweight, dropped down to 170. Very experienced. He's made some mistakes along the way. He will have learned from them, but taking this more and more seriously all the time. When we spoke to him the other day, he said he's putting a lot of effort into his strength training, core training, doing a lot of squats, a lot of deadlifts, all the usual stuff that you would expect. Working on explosivity. He needs to be sure to follow the rules as well, though. Also working on a food truck, making burgers when he's not here, taking part in Power Slap. Take a look now at the tail of the tape. Cole Young and Emmanuel Muniz. Young is three years older, one inch shorter, and it is Muniz with the one inch reach advantage. This is even as it gets. It's a pick em. Let's send it to our Power Slap announcer, Justin Bernard. Ladies and gentlemen, this match is three rounds in the Power Slap welterweight division. Introducing to you first, in the blue corner, he stands five feet, 11 inches tall, weighing in at 170 and one half pounds. Out of Hornell, New York, he is the number four ranked welterweight contender in the world, Cole Bullsen Young. And in the red corner, he stands six feet tall, weighing in at 171 pounds. Out of Ontario, California, he is the number two ranked welterweight contender in the world, Emmanuel No Love Muniz. And when the action begins, your referee in charge, Chris Tyone. Winner of the coin toss and striking first, Cole Young. 
I'm going to go back to this no shoe issue. We'll get to that in just a minute. Power Slap 3, Hints versus Wolverine, presented by Monster Energy, Unleash the Beast. Sorry, Michael, go ahead. No, 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 not at all. Um, I think it's Here a mistake. Go, I'll just say it. I think it's a big mistake because look at professional boxing. They wear boxing Thank shoes you. because you have better dra track shoes. You don't wear them in mixed martial arts because of all the grappling, and of course you can grab it, grab the foot, right. heel hooks, etc. Okay, don't move. Okay. But Hand compared right to on, striking, right, right on three, you must measure. The shoe okay. on, there's a massive difference. That's your measure. I'll count for you. We'll find out here. It seems like it's going to be hard to keep the feet grounded. Hey, well, it, well, it does that as well. Now we might generate a lot of power. We might get a knockout. But I'm willing to bet One. it will be higher. Two. With shoes on. We've oh. seen him hit harder. He was. He, that's not foul. the best slap that we've clubbing. seen from Cole Young. And, and he club. gets a clubbing foul. Ah, poor guy. One point okay, blue clubbing. One point blue clubbing. Put the shoes One on. One point blue clubbing. Can you put shoes yeah. on between rounds? I'm sure you can do it. Yeah, yeah absolutely yeah. you can. I want to shout out. Put your shoes on. Cool. Yeah, I'm ready. Okay. I'm ready. Okay, fighter recovered. Yeah, that was low okay. for sure. In just a second. There it is yeah, right see, there. Yeah, got grazed the neck right as well. Right Swiped right across the neck. Okay. Got it. I think it makes right it more difficult right to on receive three, you must the measure. slaps right as well. Right on three, you must measure. That's your measure. Muniz has power. We saw it in his last Look at that. Two. It's a good rotation. I tell you what, Cole is tough though, man, because that was a good slap. It generated a lot of power. Cole didn't took that like it was like a good flinching. flinching. That's a warning. Ooh. You flinched. It wasn't a terrible flinch, flinch, but he rolled yes, with a little early. Okay. That's not going his way. You have a choice. Well, lucky to get off with a warning, but he's going to have to take another one. Watch this. I'll take another hit. Okay. Uh, yeah. It was really slight, but it was the okay. proper Go. call. There's slight, you're talking but it's that. Chin as well. Okay, I got you. I got you. All the way up to the podium. There you go, right there. Stay straight. So here. the penalty the there, for flinching, okay. the striker yeah, gets position, to go right again, regardless okay. of whether a point right has been deducted right or not. Three. That's you punishment in itself. Okay, that is your measure. One, two. Ooh. All right, so. That's a clean strike. We could be looking at a 10-8 round. Oh, he's punishing okay. himself. Oh, push-ups. Push -ups. Well, he's trying to psych himself back up, trying yeah, to wake the time. body up, get ready to deliver yep. a potentially a knockout You've got 40 blow. 40 seconds. You've got 40 seconds. Come on, bud. He looks good, though. He looks fine. He's not wobbled. He's no, he's, right he's definitely he's fine. Right there, Still in the game. Okay. Actually, you can relax yeah, until I get him in. Okay, you good? Yeah. Okay, so, fighter recovered. Emmanuel Muniz okay. has now, five pro again. slap fights. That is as many as okay. anybody in power Ooh, slap, and he has count. never count. been knocked count. out before. Right on three, you must measure. measure. Cole Young trying to become the first right here. Let's see what he does in the second. One, two. Here we go. <laughs> Ooh, foul. solid blow. Oh, a foul again. Another foul. I think he caught him in the eye. You could see Muniz grabbing on, the eye right after he received the strike. One point blue clubbing. One point. One point blue clubbing. Fouls point blue are clubbing. killers in this sport. Remember, it was a foul in his last match that caused Cole the victory. He was a draw with Anthony Blackburn. I couldn't see from that angle. Yeah, that was a tough one, but you could see he caught him in the eye. Well, you saw straight away, as you mentioned, he grabbed the eye. It, it certainly wasn't egregious. I think his finger might have just gone up a little bit. I know he got up in your eye because he was too high. I know he doesn't Sean Strickland certainly knows what that feels like, doesn't he? Jesus Christ. got early last weekend. What are you guys up there talking about? We're in Syria, bro. What do you think we're talking about? John Davis, you got, you coaching up Moody's. Right yep. Middleweight champ. And so far, it doesn't really need any coaching. Things are going well. Here. Well, uh, at this Emmanuel, juncture, I got, wet, I got a wet rag. Cole I'm just gonna wipe is going to need a knockout to win this fight after two fouls. Well, it looks like it. Well, no, that's the fact. Like one second. 50 seconds. Unless now Moody's commits yeah, a foul. That shit sucks. That shit's going to be all swollen. I know. You'll be all right, though. You're good. You're almost there. Thank you, sir. 
40 you seconds. just you have to have got about clean shots seconds here right if you're Emmanuel Muniz. If I'm in his corner and I'm coaching him, I'm, that's all I'm saying. Feet planted, no clubbing, land clean. Come on. This match is yours. Over. Yeah, okay, focus on delivering a fair blow. Get it. Mm -hmm. There you go. Okay. Don't tuck your chin. Just okay. landed clean. Stay set. Could be, could be game set. And for the love of right. God, Cole. Right on three. Do not you must flinch. Measure. That's your measure. It looks good. Another it's good close. one. It's looks close. fair. Cole did a nice job on that. Close. What am I doing? Chris Tanyoni said it was close. Well, I, I did think it's I good. saw him move. It's just the so slightest. Slight. It's, ah. Uh, I mean. It is close. Go ahead and relax. He's being very picky. Yes, three. You think Tanyoni's being picky? You I mean, he's, you've got 40 seconds. You know, okay, so you give a little, little bit of leeway. Yeah. Take your time, man. I think you that's fair, Michael. We, we give a little leeway with, with the heel lift, right? You can have a slight yeah, heel lift. I'm saying. Shit's stupid, bro. Look at the redness, though. Okay, recovered. Fighter recovered. Okay. Is that in here? This is his last shot for Cole Young. There you go. Mm -hmm. I mean, Muniz right needs to be right seeing right stars right after this right strike three, in order for Cole Young to win. That's your Muniz needs a knockout. Sorry, uh, uh, Young needs a knockout. And if you look at the two of them, the side of the face of Young is red two. roll. And Muniz. I don't know. I think you might be able to call Muniz Third for roll. flinching there. He did it. He got like him in the eye one. again. No. I'm just okay. saying his eyes hurt, that's all. You have you have 45 seconds, okay? Just so you know. You have 45 seconds. You can talk to him if you want. Yeah, he, it, something's happening where good. Cole's I mean, as good as you're gonna in, be at the index moment. fingers coming up and fucking marks I know, scraping bro, I know. him in the eye, but I, it looked like a clean just strike your, to me. You're at 30 seconds right now. I can't hard see because of Cole's hands. 25 just seconds. Clean. Yeah. Right. Get up there and hit no, clean. No, Land no, clean. No. That was fine. That didn't touch the eye. Fighter recovered. You know, you generate a lot of power. It doesn't have to be the eye. You could have a broken orbital, for example. You could have a fracture. It just doesn't know what it feels like. Oh, you got your pen? Oh, here you go. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait, I'm go. getting hit there again. We go. There you go. There you go. My bad. My bad. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm getting hit again. Okay. Stay right there. Okay? Right on three. Again, right on three. Just, cl just landed clean. That's your measure. I mean, you could touch him with a feather and you win this thing. Did he flinch? I think he flinched more Good. this time than he did the last time. But it was that like half not gonna a matter. flinch. Yeah, I think it was half a flinch. Half a flinch. Yeah, maybe a quarter flinch. Blue started it. That's it. That's it. All right, Emmanuel All right. Muniz helped out by the fouls, landed some clean strikes. Cole Young again done it. The, the fouls are absolute killers. If I'm training for this sport, I'm so focusing. Uh, solely on that filing and then worrying about the power. It's easy to say that because the power is a big thing. The power puts people to sleep. The power generated wins fights. But of course, the fouls cause you to lose, you know? So it, it's a fine line. You want to generate as much power as possible whilst remaining in control. Too much control minimizes the power. Too much power minimizes the obedience. This sport is so young, still in its infancy. Cole Young at Power Slap 2 looked to be a win away from fighting for the title. He fought to a draw with Anthony Blackburn. He's going to lose here tonight and going to fall down the rankings, going to have to climb all the way back up. And then you have Emmanuel Muniz, who's going to improve to 4-2. and two. And, and it's a real shame as well, because go. Cole Young, he, when you talk to the guy, a real nice man, hard-working family man, strong values, loves his hunting, just a real outdoorsy type, just a solid human being. But that doesn't matter right now because, sadly, he's about to be declared the loser. Senate to Power Slap announcer Justin Bernard to make it official. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest 29-26, for the winner, by unanimous decision, Emmanuel Nolan!